going to go out with my sisters to the city to do some shopping and I'm also going to pass through the IKEA to buy new candles because if you remember I bought some candles some vlogs ago I think it was the day with like a snow vlog thingy and I got candles from the IKEA to test them out see if they're actually nice and they are actually really good so if you want good candles I recommend going to the IKEA because they're really cheap and they're also really they stay for a long time buy some stuff for my mom and then we're going to head home we have to do this in about two hours because I have an appointment later so uh, we have to not spend too much time walking around but just go 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 and now I'm about to eat some breakfast and tell me why I went to the store and I got muesli and it's I think 5 euro 50 or something like why 5 euro 80 it's 5 euro 80 that's actually crazy because the prices nowadays it's just you go to the store to buy stuff and next moment your bank account is empty so this is life right now and in terms of youtube i still want to see if i can buy like a smaller tripod because the current tripod is kind of breaking down so i want to see if i can get like another tripod and immediately one that i can also take for traveling and maybe even one that has like overhead that you can like put like this so i can have like overhead shots because i really want to have that but I don't want to get a C-stand for it. I just want to have it in one tripod. So we're on a hunt for that. So if you have any recommendations, let me know in the comments. And now I'm going to go eat some breakfast because I have talked too much. And this is the outfit of the day. Of course, we have the black pants that I usually wear. And this is a top that I did not wear the entire year. But it's still good. It's good. It's a nice, like, prop fit. I'm trying to go for, like, some more prop fits, like, over here. And pants, like, fit better here. But other than that, and then we have our gold jewelry. See, two gold rings, simple, and uh, necklace, and my earrings. And my nails are growing, so I also need to get some nail polish because I want to grow out my natural real, natural nails again. It was a, it was a time during winter and everything. I had really long nails. Those were my natural nails, so I want to see if I can like get them that long, but not too long, like a bit like this, so they just look neat. I, I I've always been a nail biter, so. When it comes to nails, I was not really confident I could grow them long anymore, but after literally just taking my time, taking care of them, being careful and everything, they grow, so oh, they grew, so now they're growing out again, so I'm have to take care of them, put some nail polish, and then hopefully they'll be long again in about two months. I'm a bit addictive, yeah, addictive to these because if I start eating them, I eat until I get sick, which is really bad. got some nail polish my nails are growing out as I said before so they're not really nice but if I cover them in this they'll be looking good again so I decided to get a different color this time gray yes, is okay this is a grail this is a grail a gray nail polish and I got a black one 
I had a face that I had black nail polish. I don't know. Kind of looks nice. Or is it too much? I don't know. So this is the nail polish I'll be using right now. And this is a biscuits I'll be eating. And I'm currently watching. Honestly, has become like one of my favorite YouTubers at the moment. And that is Wow Polo. Wow Polo. He's just, his stuff is just amazing. And I love his way of filming and now i'm watching his creator camp movie i'll just call it a movie because the shots and the colors and the everything it just looks amazing and i definitely recommend you to follow him on instagram if you are interested in filmmaking stuff just make sure to follow him he creates amazing stuff so uh, i'm watching that right now and i'll probably take a quick nap because i slept way too less two TikToks done, finalize and double check my vlog that I've created and I want to create like a postcard video since I will not be home in, during the weekend I'm gonna try and do some more work now so that when I come back from my weekend I won't be stressed to do work so first we're gonna have some breakfast and I have to record some videos for my mom I'm currently working on her rebranding and relaunch of her whole uh, stuff on YouTube, TikTok, Instagram and I'm really happy with how I edited the pictures in Lightroom I don't know if you guys remember it in the vlog and uh, I showcased like the pictures that I took. I took some pictures and now I have learned how to edit them in Lightroom because of my internship. And I'm pretty happy with how they turned out and she was pretty satisfied too, so that's a good sign. So uh, I'll be working on that. I'll probably also try to like finalize my new web design for Studio Art Designs. And then uh, we have some other stuff I need to do. So today is a pretty busy day, but I will try to get as much work done as possible. So uh, let's get started today. This place is actually filthy. I'm not gonna sit on this because it looks oh, oh hot for Ugh, it's disgusting. Wanna stand? It, the log is very dirty. Carney upseta. There's this thing that happens when you shoot in full light. It's that it becomes very dark if you use an ND filter. So I'm trying to start learning how to use that. But I decided to come out to the park to record like a short introduction for this video. I was originally wanted to like go and shoot inside the park. But um, there were dogs running, I'm scared of dogs, so I decided to just come here. Uh, anyways, basically what I want to say, I'm going to start relaunching my business studio, Hard Designs. 
think about two years ago I started my business and registered it, but I see that after two years starting my job as an intern, focusing on that, focusing on YouTube, I basically just let it go and didn't focus on creating my passion projects anymore and working on Studio Heart Science. So if you have a business, it requires work and I didn't put in the work to build the business. So what I want to start doing for this year is to start putting the foundation right and start working on my business again. And um, what's my game plan on this is first by redesigning my website, uploading some new cases and then from there I'll be posting at least every week one case on my Instagram and start reaching out to potential clients. At least that's my game plan and also trying to maybe add TikTok to my brand strategy. So I've already been working a bit of like redesign so like uh, I decided to try redesigning my logo. Honestly, I decided let me just let it be because I've had several rebrands in the past. And um, I think it's now it's important to just stick to it and just create a good website, good cases, and from there we can move on. So I just wanted to come out here and record that real quick so it has a different environment instead of being out uh, inside the house always. And it's getting sunny, as you can see, it's getting sunny. And, and I, see I see the two, the two dogs, dogs coming, coming, so I'm about to stop, stop recording, recording and getting my ass inside the car. Goodbye. Dog. <laughs> about to head home, uh, drop my sister. I record some shots here for my Instagram and uh, I'll be using that as a like short cinematic video. And I'll probably come back here to shoot because it's a pretty nice location actually. I'm actually going to start recording in public and I can do this without feeling ashamed doing it just picking up the camera and recording it's over YouTube is going to be on top of my game I'm going to be going out and just recording in public without giving a shit and my two biggest inspirations for those at the moment is Joe Arak if I'm saying his name correctly the way he just records and just does it it's just I admire him and also Wal Polo on Instagram I've mentioned him before the way he just records is clean and he doesn't give a shit about others, at least that's the impression it gives and that's how I want to become and start becoming for this year. So that's the goal and I want to actually achieve this goal before next month. I think that's a good goal. Before next month, I want to be confident in recording in public and just give a sh don't give a shit and just do it. And now I'm about to go. My says mom has to drop off my sister and then I'm about to go. But this is a good, uh, good start. changed my glass protector as you can see it's really broken I decided not to change it directly as a way to like punish myself because I always let these things fall and I think I've had over five maybe even more and they're like 15 euros each so you can see how much I spent so I decided to get a new one <laughs> 